One Logics is a niche logistics service provider and has been listed on the JSC Altex since 2004. It's the amalgamation of seven companies, niche transport and services companies. It has a market cap of 452 million rand, a price to earnings ratio of nine and a dividend yield of 4.6% and a relatively impressive looking share price mm. graph. So One Logics, let's get the lowdown on it from you, Paul. I'm yeah, sure you'll give it to us. It, the group owes its form now to an uh, energetic CEO by the name of uh, Lawrence. I know is his first name. Ian, Ian Lawrence. Like yours. Ian, Ian Lawrence. Lawrence. Okay. So what Ian has done is he's put together these businesses. He's kept everybody happy. The directors between them control, I think, about 60% of the shares. The core of the business are two divisions. It's a specialist vehicle transportation business, those trucks with the two levels that you transport new vehicles around from you know, where they're made to where the dealers want them. And then there's also a business called RFB, which does abnormal load uh, transport and you know the infrastructure project. So a nice business. It's got rising earnings. It's gathering moss. It's uh, one of those smaller companies that's getting talked about around the place. So if it can continue to deliver that growth story, that's great. And it can prosper and go further from But this there. one's not too frothy up here, is it? Well, I think the problem is some of those vehicle transportation businesses are seen as a bit mature. Some of their other businesses like PostNet and uh, you know, MagScene are, in my opinion, not all that exciting. So I think it's sort of <laughs> reaching a potential danger zone. A bit yeah, of a and plateau. I just wanted to push him on that point to see whether he was uh, mindful of the fact that it could be frothy. What, well, is this distribution level or accumulation exactly, level? Exactly. Distribution. Distribution level. Yeah. You don't believe that it's got further upside? Not right now. I think to, to take it further, Ian will have to go and find something else to buy. Yes. And I think the logistics area is plenty of players there to yes. incorporate. But understand that it's not as though they invented this business or that they don't have competition. We mentioned Supergroup, we mentioned Imperial, we mentioned... All right, Big so Desk. this is, we, we're clear then, it's distribution level right now. Yeah. You would say, sure. take your money and run. Can I Look, be that blunt about it? The ratios are fair. PE of nine, dividend yield of four and a half. That's pretty good. But no, thank you. It's had a good run. That's enough. Thank you. Yeah, and you know my rule of thumb is anything under a billion you've got to be careful about. Yeah. So at 462, still a little bit small, but I think, again, one to watch. I'm not so convinced about your rule of thumb, <laughs> but anyway, it is your rule of thumb. Yeah. So when we go hot or not... Not hot for me. Hot or not, not Ian? Hot. No.